If you type in your landing URL and click the bottom, what we'll do is we'll scrub your main elements automatically and create variants for each element. So we'll create some experiments based on your landing page content. So here's the result. We've got a series of experiments based on the main elements. You can see we have an H1 experiment, a description experiment, and the CTA experiment all created automatically. You can hover on the variants and see what each variant looks like. Let's go ahead and create our account. We can edit all of these afterwards, so don't worry. So our account has been created. All we need to do now is paste this snippet in the head tag of our website. So the snippet has been installed. Let's check the installation. Seems to be good. So now we can take a look at how our variants look like from the website. Here you can see the H1 was changed to the content of the variant. And we can make further edits if we wish to. Let's change the color for this um, text. We can even alter other elements as well. It doesn't need to be just a one element. Let's save changes and finish. So now that we've got our changes uh, ready, we can set our goal, our experiment goal. We'll keep it simple and choose a um, goal based on element clicks. So we'll use the visual builder to select which element we wish to track clicks for. We'll select the CTA, click OK. Looks good, the goal has been set. And now we can finally launch our experiment, OK? Once the experiment is running, if I go to, the, to my um, to my landing page, I should expect to get a variant assigned. So there we go. It detected the experiment, uh, displayed a variant for us, and we can see this data. Ah, sorry. <laughs> Once the session of user session finishes, you can expect to see this data show up in the analytics. So here we have a session detected. If we do that again, so let me trigger another session. We just got the same variant. I'll um, perform the action being tracked, which is this button click. So if I refresh, we've got a conversion assigned as well. So there we go. We've got our experiment up and running and tracking conversions.